Hi, I'm Steve Harper, ex Newcastle United, Hull City, and many others, and you're watching Mariners TV. So, who are you saying for South Shields? A lot of people like raise their eyebrows at that, but why have you made a decision? Uh, well, I mean, I've been in, in talk with, uh, with uh, Sean and the chairman. Um, you know, they were they're really exciting of uh, obviously bringing the club up um, and progressing, making the club bigger. So uh, they asked me about you know um, an opportunity to come and play for, for the club, and and I think uh, we we go into an agreement now where obviously I'm gonna try to play as much as I can, uh, obviously as long as my my feet uh, and my injury that uh, it made me stop playing professional let me play. So so yeah, that's the idea. Uh, bring some excitement to the club. Uh, I know the team is doing really well top of the league at the moment. So hopefully get more fans uh, interested in coming and watch the team. And obviously the idea is to, to win the league, as far as I know. So it's been quite a while that you've been in talks and have you been sort of watching what's been happening from afar with the club? Yeah, well, I, uh, funny enough, I've been, I've been here since um, well, I came here before the season started, so they told me all about it, uh, what they're looking for and what's the idea, uh, a long plan term. Mm -hmm. Uh, so, so yes, I mean everything look uh, exciting, you know, and uh, obviously you got a good chairman uh, back in the club up. So that's that's a good a good thing to have. Uh, obviously the the coaching stuff um, is doing well as well, and, and they got the players. So everything to be to be in order uh, to hopefully uh, get promotion. Obviously the chairman's put on record all of all of his plans with the club where he wants it to go over a long term period. Is that something that's excited you as well? Well, obviously, it's good to have a plan. Um, you know, it's always good to have a plan, and uh, and that's what he's doing. Uh, he got a plan where he's, uh, he's working through the years, and this year, obviously, the main thing is to get promotion, and then hopefully next year they might, you know, progress in something else and, and trying to get promotion again. And um, no, it's good. Uh, plus, he's a local, he's a local guy. You know, he born here. He knows everything about the city and the fans and the club. Uh, so I'm sure he's. Uh, well, I'm sure he's prepared to help the club as much as he can. And obviously, in your time at England with Sunderland and Mills, where you played left back or centre midfield or left wing, what would you say is your best position at this stage? Well, I mean, uh, I've been playing in Sunderland League last season. Uh, just basically to keep myself fit and play with some friends. Uh, I was playing centre mid, left back. So, uh, as long as you know, uh, I play in that position, I think uh, it should be all right. Uh, obviously. I'm not sure what the what the team is looking for, uh, what position the manager is looking me to play. But um, but yeah, I'm prepared to play in different positions as long as uh, I can do the work. And obviously, you've been around the club today. You've met a few of the sort of old timers like Richard and, and Jerry. Have you been yeah. impressed by sort of their hard work as well? And, and their yeah, sort of yeah, of course. This? Especially with well, the two of them, well, Sherry. You know, when I saw him working uh, around the field, you know, I couldn't believe his ADA. Um, uh, and Richard as well, you know, uh, looking after the place. Obviously, you can't see like uh, people that really care about the club. Uh, they've been here for, as you say, for a long, long time, and and it's good to have these kind of people around. You know, it's like a it's like a family club mm -hmm. uh, when you see that. So, so yes, uh, fantastic. You know, uh, it's great to see people like that. Obviously, the standard of football that you're going to be going into is not going to be the same that you've been used to with Premier League level, for example, but. What sort of challenge do you think that's going to bring to you as a player? Well, I think, uh, as, as you said before, you know, South Shields is getting bigger. Mm -hmm. um, the, the club is investing a lot of money in players, in, 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 in the stadium. Um, so it's becoming a big name and everyone, in a, everyone wants to beat South Shields now, you know, because of the, the way things are progressing. So, so yeah, I mean, the standard of football, I saw them playing a few weeks ago against the um, See and Red Star, and the standard is good. You know uh, the lads are fit. You know it's a it's a good pace. So so yeah, I mean uh, you have to prepare to to work hard. It's not going to be you know an easy games. Uh, so but I, I believe you know for what I heard the the team got the quality to to obviously play good football and, and win games. And it's a big aim for you to sort of win this league now and sort of achieve something with this club as well. Well, I'm very competitive, uh, really really competitive in what I do. So. You know, if I come and play here, obviously, uh, yes, I want to win every game. You know, that's what happened last season when I was playing Sunday League with my friends. You know, it was I was probably with one of the most competitive in the team mm -hmm. uh, because if I do something, I want to do it right. So, so yeah, that's the idea. If I come here, I want to do it right. I want to play right, and no messing around. 
And obviously you're going to meet your new teammates soon as well. Is that something that you're looking forward to get, getting with the group again? And yeah, we good. I mean, uh, I don't know, I don't know any of the lads. Uh, I, don't, I don't think I know any one of them. Um, so it be good. Uh, yes, I'm gonna try to come here tomorrow, uh, watch a game, and, and and try to meet up with the lads and, and see what they like. But uh, yeah, I mean, the match told me that it's a good group of lads uh, trying to pull together to obviously get results and, and win the league. And I hopeful as well like, that your presence might bring a few more people through the gate as well, might increase the attendance even further. Well, that's the idea. I mean, at the end of the day, is uh, me being here. Hopefully, uh, help the club as well. You know, um, so for the club, yeah, fans. Hopefully, Sunderland fans. I know South Shields is about you know half Newcastle, half Sunderland. So hopefully, the the Sunderland fans that uh, saw me playing before for the for the club uh, follow me here and uh, and came on, and come and watch uh, obviously the games. So that'll be, that'll be excellent and, and that hopefully give more publicity to the team that uh, that's that's what the, the team is looking for as well. You've obviously have been playing with Will Pond as well, is that going to be something that will continue this season as well? No, I don't think it's going to happen. Uh, I don't think my my body will, will let me play two games in, in one weekend. Uh, I don't like last season, um, it went well, we got promotion with the team. Um, but this season uh, I've been doing my, my coaching badges, I've been coaching in, in different places. So. Uh, hopefully I get the time to play on the weekends here. Uh, I'm not sure about the week, but uh, I'm going to try as well if I can play during the week. But uh, no, if we, if I start playing here, I'm going to concentrate just in, in playing here. And how is the fitness at the moment as well? Yeah, it's good. I mean, uh, I haven't played probably for the last uh, six, seven weeks. But, uh, you know, I look after myself. Uh, I like to do my exercise, go for a run. So I don't think it'd be a problem to, to get myself fit straight away. Um, but uh, it's always different when you play, you know. Um, but yeah, I'm prepared. I'm prepared. As I said before, I look after myself, so I don't think uh, that's going to be a problem. And just finally, when do you see yourself pull on the shirt for the first time, your first, first game for the club? Well, hopefully if everything goes okay, um, everything gets sorted uh, between today and tomorrow. Uh, hopefully a week tomorrow, uh, I should be here uh, for, for the game and hopefully play. That's going to be another another home game uh, next Saturday. So so yes, I'm looking to, to start uh, that weekend. Uh, as I say, if everything goes okay, but look like everything should be fine for next week.